हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस वीडियो इज हेल्पफुल फॉर स्टूडेंट्स परसुइंग एम बी ए और प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर सी एफ ए और एफ आर एम द टॉपिक फॉर दिस वीडियो एज एविडेंट इज क्रेडिट डिफॉल्ट स्वाप आई चूज दिस एज रिसेंटली टॉमस कुक वॉज इन न्यूज टॉमस कुक हैज डिफॉल्टेड एंड इन्वेस्टर्स इन इट्स बॉन्ड्स गॉट पेड बाई द सी डी एस सेलर्स सी डी एस मीन्स क्रेडिट डिफॉल्ट स्वाप इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन द टर्म क्रेडिट डिफॉल्ट स्वाप लेट एस अंडरस्टैंड दिस कंसेप्ट यूजिंग एन एग्जाम्पल फर्स्ट कम बैक टू दिस इलस्ट्रेशन वेरी सून फर्स्ट एज्यूम दैट देयर इज अ फंड हाउस ए एंड दे वॉन्ट टू इन्वेस्ट टेन मिलियन डॉलर्स वन ऑप्शन विद दैम इज इन्वेस्ट इन अ रिस्क फ्री बॉन्ड रिस्क फ्री बॉन्ड्स आर इशूड बाई द सॉवरेन एंड देयर इज नो रिस्क ऑफ डिफॉल्ट द सेकेंड ऑप्शन अवेलेबल विद दैम इज टू इन्वेस्ट इन अ रिस्की बॉन्ड एंड रिस्की बॉन्ड ईल्स मोर द ईल्ड इज सेवन परसेंट सेवन परसेंट मीन्स टू हंड्रेड बेसिस पॉइंट मोर दैन द रिस्क फ्री रेट सो द ईल्ड एसोसिएटेड विद द रिस्की बॉन्ड इज हायर द कॉर्पोरेट डेट बॉन्ड्स कम विद द रिस्क इन्वॉल्व इन इट विच इज द रिस्क ऑफ डिफॉल्ट सो नाउ एज्यूम दैट फंड हाउस ए गोज विद द सेकेंड ऑप्शन एंड बाई द रिस्की रिस्की बॉन्ड which gives 200 basis points extra yield you may assume that uh, this fund house is a hedge fund and the bond issuer is thomas cook to understand the example so therefore uh, the spread is 200 basis or 2% a basis point is 100 part of a percent spread is the extra yield or return that is earned by the investor in risky asset over the risk free rate now the fund house wants to protect itself from the risk so what he does they approach a protection provider c c you may assume that it is the city group now friends here uh, this very carefully the protection provider or the protection seller c provides protection to protection buyer the fund house a for which a has to pay a premium this premium is in this example it is 50 50 basis points protection buyer pays a premium to protection seller in exchange for payment if default occurs the premium paid by a is a part of the extra return which is earned by the investor by investing in the risky bond over the risk free bond so it is a part of that 200 basis points 50 basis points is given from the 200 basis points so here if you see the extra return for a is so the extra return for the a was 200 basis points out of these 200 basis points 50 basis points are given to the protection provider so the net return available with the investor is 100 basis points over and above the risk free rate so friends i hope by now you have understood whatever i have told you let us now understand transactions in different scenario the first case when there was no default the fund issuer x y z suppose does not default so if there is no default then the fund house a will get back its invested money from the issuer x y z itself and the protection provided provider does not have to pay any amount to the fund house a but suppose there is a default and the x y z issuer is not able to pay the money so what happens then the fund house will approach provider protection provider c to give some amount and what is that amount it is the loss loss is whatever the fund house is able to recover uh, that will be deducted and in, from the invested amount and the re, uh, the loss will be paid by the protection provider so one term we also have to understand which is recovery rate recovery rate is a rate at which the lender or the issuer uh, the the investor is able to recover per dollar amount from the asset so uh, suppose we assume that there the recovery rate is 30% this means that if the bond is auctioned 3 million is recovered from that auction of the bond after default and the protection provider is required to pay only 7 million to the investor that is the fund house a now uh, let us come back to the illustration which uh, puts all this in uh, one slide the protection buyer a enters into a 1 year credit default swap on a notional of 10 million us dollar worth of 5 year bonds 
issued by XYZ. The swap entails an annual payment of 50 basis points at the beginning of the year. At the beginning of the year, suppose $50,000 were paid to the protection seller, the C. Assume that before the end of the year, company XYZ defaults on this bond, which now trades at 30 cents on the dollar. The protection provider counterparty then has to pay 7 million US dollars to the investor A. Thank you friends. If you liked your my channel, uh, you, you may subscribe it and uh, also please share with your friends. Thank you.